the universe and everything in it, the earth, we humans, all the life around us and all the inanimate objects like the TV or computer you're watching this video on are made from elementary particles of matter. The universe and all matter was created roughly 14 billion years ago by a giant burst of energy, the Big Bang. At a research complex near the western end of Lake Geneva, straddling the border between France and Switzerland, sits CERN, the European Organization for Particle Physics Research. Thousands of researchers from all over the world have come to CERN. The focus of their attention is the Large Hadron Collider. The LHC has just inaugurated its seventh experiment, MODEL. The LHC ring is 27 kilometers in circumference and houses thousands of magnets that guide counter-rotating beams of protons into collisions that generate the unprecedented energy of 14 million million electron volts per collision. The LHC ring lies 100 meters underground. The protons travel in opposing directions and accelerate to collision energy, which is close to the speed of light. The modal collaboration has built a detector to search for the magnetic monopole, a hypothetical particle with a magnetic charge, discovery of which would be of fundamental importance. The monopole detector is an array of 400 modules, each consisting of a stack of 10 sheets of plastic. The total area of plastic is 250 square meters. The modal detector is essentially a giant camera waiting to photograph the telltale signs of new physics. The plastic detectors are its film. The proton beams collide, recreating quite literally a tiny big bang. If magnetic monopoles exist, they will be created in this fireball, rushing away from its fiery center like shrapnel from a bomb, their trajectory to be recorded by the detector. The magnetic monopoles will rip through the plastic sheets of the detector, breaking through its long chain molecules, creating a minute trail of damage through all 10 sheets of plastic. The path of damage in the plastic sheets is revealed by the process of etching in a caustic solution of hot sodium hydroxide. The etch cones on either side of the plastic are formed as the etchant eats away at the magnetic monopole's path. Eventually the two cones meet to form a hole. The clear indication of the path of a monopole is an aligned set of holes with the trajectory pointing back to the collision point. Just one event like this could herald the existence of the magnetic monopole and revolutionize our understanding of the physical universe. <laughs>